In the heart of Slavic folklore, where tales of magic and mystery intertwine, there exists a figure both feared and revered, a name whispered in hushed tones by children and adults alike, Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga, often described as the Witch of the Woods, is not your typical fairy tale witch. Her name translates to Grandmother Snake or Old Woman Snake, reflecting her connection to the primal forces of nature. With her iron teeth, long bony legs, and a nose that touches the ceiling when she sleeps, she's a sight to behold. But it's not just her appearance that captures the imagination. Her dwelling, a peculiar hut that stands on chicken legs, has become an iconic symbol in many tales. This hut, they say, turns its back to visitors and only reveals its entrance to those who know the secret chant. Little house, little house, turn your back to the forest, your front to me. For generations, Slavic grandparents have regaled their grandchildren with tales of Baba Yaga, stories where she plays the role of both the antagonist and, at times, the unexpected savior. Her importance in Slavic folklore cannot be understated. To truly understand Baba Yaga, we must journey back in time, delving deep into the annals of history and the very roots of Slavic culture. The earliest mentions of Baba Yaga can be traced back to medieval Slavic tales and legends. The first documented evidence of Baba emerges in woodblock prints from the late 17th century. These stories, passed down orally from one generation to the next, painted a vivid picture of a world where magic was real and creatures like Baba Yaga roamed the land. But where did the inspiration for such a character come from? Some historians believe that Baba Yaga may have been inspired by real-life figures or events. Perhaps she was a shamanistic figure, or maybe a representation of the fears and anxieties of ancient Slavic communities. As with all legends, the character of Baba Yaga evolved over time. While her core attributes remained consistent, different eras added their own twists and interpretations. In some tales, she's a malevolent force, while in others, she's a wise old woman offering guidance. Yet, through all these variations, one thing remains clear. Baba Yaga's influence on Slavic folklore is profound and enduring, a testament to the power of storytelling and the human imagination. Beyond the tales and legends, what truly sets Baba Yaga apart is her unmistakable appearance, a visage that has haunted dreams and inspired countless interpretations. With iron teeth that can chew through bone and a nose so long it's said to touch the ceiling of her hut when she sleeps, Baba Yaga is far from the stereotypical image of a witch. Her long, bony fingers, often depicted clutching herbs or magical items, further add to her distinctiveness. But her peculiarities don't end with her looks. Instead of a broomstick, Baba Yaga travels in a mortar, pushing herself along with a pestle, an image as iconic as the witch herself. And then there's her dwelling, a hut Unlike any other, perched atop chicken legs, this structure is as much a part of the Baba Yaga legend as the witch herself. It's said that the hut can move at her command, turning its back to unwanted visitors and revealing its entrance only to those deemed worthy. Artists and storytellers alike have been captivated by this unique abode, each adding their own flair and interpretation. Yet the essence remains the same, a dwelling that is as mysterious and enigmatic as Baba Yaga herself. Throughout the ages, tales of Baba Yaga have been told and retold, each story revealing a different facet of this enigmatic witch. In many tales, Baba Yaga is portrayed as a gatekeeper of sorts, guarding the boundaries between the known and the unknown, the world of the living and the realm of the dead. Heroes and heroines often find themselves crossing paths with Baba Yaga, seeking her wisdom or attempting to outwit her in a test of wits. These encounters are rarely straightforward, for dealing with Baba Yaga is a risky endeavor. 
Yet, not all tales paint her as a malevolent force. In some, her role is more ambiguous. She might test the protagonist's character, rewarding the virtuous and punishing the wicked. These tales often carry moral lessons, teaching values like honesty, bravery, and respect. The versatility of Baba Yaga's character allows her to fit seamlessly into a myriad of stories. From cautionary tales warning children of the dangers of the forest to epic quests where she plays a pivotal role, Baba Yaga's presence is always felt, her influence undeniable. And so from generation to generation, the tales of Baba Yaga continue to enchant and inspire, a testament to the timeless allure of folklore. Baba Yaga, with her many facets, is not just a character in tales. She embodies deeper meanings, symbolizing aspects of life, nature, and the human psyche. In many interpretations, Baba Yaga is seen as a representation of nature in its rawest form. Wild, unpredictable, and untamed, she embodies the cycles of life and death, growth and decay. Her dual nature, both benevolent and malevolent, mirrors the duality of nature itself. Just as the forest can provide sustenance and shelter, it can also be a place of danger and mystery. This duality extends to her role in tales. At times, she's the wise old woman offering guidance. At others, she's the formidable obstacle to be overcome. This complexity makes her a figure of intrigue, open to countless interpretations. Modern psychologists often delve into the symbolism of Baba Yaga, seeing her as a representation of the subconscious mind or as an archetype of the wild feminine. Her tales, rich in symbolism, offer insights into human fears, desires, and the journey of self-discovery. From ancient tales whispered around campfires to the silver screens of modern cinemas, Baba Yaga's influence transcends time, captivating new generations in unexpected ways. In films, TV shows, and literature, Baba Yaga has been reimagined and reinvented. Sometimes she's the central antagonist, a force to be reckoned with. In others, she's a mysterious ally, her motives ever enigmatic. The digital realm, too, has embraced the legend. Video games depict her as a formidable boss, a quest giver, or even a playable character. Each interpretation offers players a unique encounter with the famed witch. Beyond the screen and page, Baba Yaga's influence permeates popular culture. Artists, musicians, and designers draw inspiration from her tales, ensuring her legacy remains vibrant and relevant. And so, from folklore to blockbuster hits, from ancient tales to modern memes, Baba Yaga's story continues to evolve, a testament to her enduring appeal and the timeless magic of storytelling. Mythology, a tapestry of tales and characters, binds cultures together. And while Baba Yaga stands as a unique pillar in Slavic folklore, parallels can be drawn with other legendary figures. Witches, sorceresses, wise women, many cultures have their own versions. Yet each carries its distinct flavor, shaped by the beliefs and values of its people. While some witches are known for their malevolent intentions, others serve as protectors or guides. Baba Yaga, with her dual nature, shares similarities with many of these figures, yet her story remains distinctly Slavic. Comparing her to other mythical figures offers a deeper understanding of not just Baba Yaga, but of the universal themes that myths address, themes of life, death, nature, and the unknown. While she might share the wisdom of a shamaness from Native American tales or the cunning of a witch from African legends, Baba Yaga's essence, shaped by centuries of Slavic history and culture, sets her apart. As our journey through the enigmatic world of Baba Yaga draws to a close, we reflect on the indelible mark she has left on the tapestry of folklore. From ancient Slavic tales to modern pop culture, Baba Yaga's presence is felt across generations. 
Her tales, rich in symbolism and nuance, resonate with timeless themes that speak to the human experience. The enduring appeal of Baba Yaga stories lies in their ability to captivate and inspire. They remind us of the magic of storytelling, its power to transport us to other worlds, and its role in preserving cultural heritage. As we pass these tales down from one generation to the next, we ensure that the legacy of Baba Yaga and the rich tapestry of folklore from which she emerges remains alive and cherished. I hope this video has given you a better understanding of Baba Yaga and her role in Slavic folklore. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more videos on mythology and folklore from around the world. Thank you for watching.